Hi everybody, I hope you're all doing great. Today we're gonna to cover selling a stock on the Charles Schwab mobile app using a limit. Uh, we're gonna take the same example that we, um, from yesterday and instead of buying it, we're gonna put a sell order in for it. Yesterday we bought T-Mobile. Um, finding your, your transactions that you wanna sell or your trades that you wanna sell as you get into the Charles Schwab mobile app can be a little confusing at first. Either you can get it through your account or you can get it through an order or you could do it from searching from it. It's not as easy as Robinhood or as easy as uh, even Ameritrade. So it's a little confusing if you're selling um, the first couple of times. So just uh, dig into it through one of those ways. Uh, we're gonna go through the order since we bought it yesterday. Uh, just tap on the order. You'll be able to see the details of the order. Um, we'll take, click on the top, which will take us into the stock itself. It's gone up a little bit today. I'm going to hit on trade. Uh, it's the trade details. I'm going to do uh, a sell order. We only bought one yesterday. Uh, we're on our Charles Schwab testing account where we try out different uh, trading tactics and Robinhood given notification. We also have Robinhood, Webbull, et cetera, on this mobile device, so may get more notifications. So if you enter the quantity of one, hit done. Uh, you wanna do a limit order. The limit amount that we recommend is to get out at 5%. That's our targeted gain for prep to grow We get out of that uh, without question. Uh, we have volume of recommendations every day on average about 16, so um, we sell, we have a set gain, get out, by the next one. So in this case, the 5% gain from our buy price is 118.97. We're just gonna call it even and say 119 will be the limit sell price. Limits are great from the standpoint of you don't have to watch it. Um, when it hits that number, it'll sell off. Uh, and timing a 5% gain is very hard to do. Uh, but the limit order, if you put it as good until canceled, uh, it'll be there for the next 60 days, and when it ever hits that, even if it's for a second, uh, and there's an order for it, and you're selected, then it'll sell off. So it's a good way to do it without having to constantly go in and monitor the progress of it. So from here, we'll hit review order, validate that it uh, matches everything that we want it to. You gotta scroll to the bottom. If something doesn't look right, you can tap on change or you decide to cancel you hit don't, don't do not place uh, in this case we'll do place order it'll take you to the verification of the order that it's they've received it and then you're pretty much done um, straightforward the only difficult part about selling a stock on Charles Schwab is actually getting to the sell page itself um, so just navigate through it through either again through the search field through the, the brokerage or your broker account or through a previous order. But I uh, hope you find this helpful. If you have any questions, uh, please feel free to reach out to us. But happy trading.